God is speaking to you today, some people need to go out of your life and some people need to stay in your life. Some doors had to be closed that you thought you needed in your life. Some doors need to be opened behind closed doors to get exactly what you need. Do you know the story of Jarius? Girl, right? I forced the people in the room where he was lying to leave. I only allowed a few people to stay in the room because they believed in me in and knew what I would do. Then I closed the door of the room. Because I had to open another door to supernatural wonders for him. This means that around, people can stand send away the few people who were in room. Close the door. About, people in your life that you thought you needed may have left, and about, people still remain. You may feel like there are closed doors in your life. Don't worry because I have to perform a supernatural miracle in your life. Let's get some people up. Let out some of the people who were present in your life. Closing one door opens another wonderful door that no one can close for my glory. That's why always focuses on me. I know what I am doing. I know why I'm doing all this. I say one thing, everything is for your good. So trust me. God tells you today, I never promised you an easy life, but I promised a fulfilling life. There is certainly hope for you in the future, and your hope will not be dashed. So always rejoice. Pray constantly and thank me whatever happens, since I formed you, whatever season you are in, it will be according to my plan and my will. So don't worry. Sometimes you may not understand some things, but you have to understand and know who I am and is there something that is impossible for me? So you have a choice, either you can focus on what, you didn't understand, or you can find joy in what you did understand. So, despite the circumstances, he begins to search for my God. Maybe the G door will close someday because I have something better in the store than having to go through another door in to get there. When things don't go your way, remember, my successes and start keeping an eye on for the next opportunity that will reveal my final plan to you along the way. I am always loyal and you can trust me. Always remember that you have the promise of my unchanging omnipotence and faithfulness. So don't worry, trust me. God is speaking to you today. When I made the promise to Abraham, I told him to wait, because I had a plan. When Daniel was thrown into the lion's den, I never let him go, because I had a plan. When Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego were thrown into the fiery furnace, I never took that situation away from them, because I had a plan when I led the Israelites to the Red Sea. I had a plan. When Joseph was thrown into the pit and into prison in, I never took that situation away from him, because I had a plan. I never stopped Peter and his friends from fishing all night long because I had a plan for in the morning. Whenever I make something happen, I will never do anything without a plan. You may go through around situations in your life, the reason for which you may not know, but let me tell you, there are still blessings waiting for you. So don't lose faith when you see your situation. So believe in me. Go ahead 
trust me and know who I am. Always remember that I am your God.